this is Daniel from the Miami Beach Botanical Garden. Today we're going to create a palette garden. What you need to create your palette garden is a palette. Weed cloth, a staple gun, and soil. This is our very own garden blend. Finally, you'll need beautiful summer plants. So the next part of creating our pallet garden is taking our reed cloth and cutting it into eight pieces of 15 by 30 rectangles, just like this. What I do is I place the weed cloth in the middle of the pallet, press it down gently, and I start to staple from inside to the outside corner. Take the staple gun and start. Okay. Once you finish stapling this side, you take your shade cloak down, square off the edges to about two inches below the pallet. Then you continue to staple on this side, straight across to the end. Then you finish your corners evenly and then you're ready to add soil. Okay, the next part of creating our pallet garden is adding soil. Our soil comes from the compost tub. It's a mechanical blend consisting of finished compost, perlite, peat moss, and slow-release fertilizer. This will give our plants the nutrients they need. I will start out with three scoops per section. Now we get to the fun part, choosing our plants. I like to do the thriller, spiller, and filler method of planting my pallet garden. So I want to start with my thriller. This is our zinnia that I'm taking out from its pot, removing some of the roots from the bottom and opening them up. Before I put into the pallet. Now I'm adding our spiller. I'm taking this pothos out of its pot, loosening the roots, and adding it to the top of our pallet. This will spill down nicely and add character to our pallet garden. Now I'm ready to add the filler. These coleuses are beautiful and add a pop of color. I'm adding the coleus to our top palette and I will finish with soil. Now we're going to plant the second shelf. Since there's a lot of space here, I have two different types of liriope, the blue shade and the variegated. So I'm going to use the variegated to add a pop of color and lightness. I'm removing it from the pot, opening up the roots, and adding to the middle of our palette. Now I'm adding our terenia. I'm taking it out of the pot, removing some of the bottom roots, opening it up, and adding it to the second row of the pallet garden. Lastly, I will add 
our purple heart. This adds color and it hangs nicely. I'll remove some of the roots, add it to the second row. As you see, we've done two rows of our palette garden. I will continue with all the rest of the rows, adding soil to each row. Here are these steps. Plant the palette garden from top to bottom, both sides, and with the magic of television, we'll be back with a beautiful, finished palette garden. Welcome back. As promised, our completed palette garden the thriller, spiller, filler version of planting. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Stay tuned for more upcoming virtual programming for the Miami Beach Botanical Garden. Thanks for watching. See you next time.